Hello there guys and gals, the Welsh Centre here, back with yet another 100% achievement guide. And this time we're getting it all in the letter, a horror visual novel. Now this was developed by Yang Yang Mobile, published by East Asia Soft, and it's available for usually £16.74, but always look out for a sale. So the story basically goes, seven people fall prey to a vicious curse and, you know, horror and stuff. Hmm. Plus, you choices to make the story unfold, so there's that aspect too, which is pretty cool, but if you're simply after achievements, then look no further. Now, we can get this done in around 15 to 20 minutes with one full playthrough and two half playthroughs. Now, unlike other visual novel games, there are actually quick time events that we have to do, but we only need to do four and then we can turn them off and skip them completely. Now, there's just one uh, quick time event that may take you a few minutes, but the rest are pretty much easy. So, with all that being said then, let us begin. But, just like in every other visual novel, go down to options, and then we're going to um, go down and go to skip stops at all text, and then choose instant for skip mode, and put the text speed all the way up to full if you want as well. Press the X button to successfully apply them, so make sure they're on all text and instant, then we can start a new game. Uh, with a little bit of a jump in, um, crap in your pants style scare there at the beginning. So that's always good. So at the bottom right, you can see there's things for us to do. And basically, all we're going to be doing is getting the skip icon. So press Y to go to skip. And we will go to this first dialogue option. Now, every dialogue option that we're going to pick for this particular playthrough will always be the top option. So for every single dialogue option... All you need to do is press the top one. Now, this is the first quick time event, but what we're going to do is just leave it, and we're going to die. We're going to get, hey, baby mama, what you, what, you you come around here often? Uh, oh, my God. Oh, that's my genitals. God, get off. She's ripped my balls off, man. No, what we're going to do, though, is actually just lose <laughs> that quick time event. When that happens, we can press the continue. Um, go over to skip at the bottom right-hand corner, and then immediately mash the X button as quick as you can. You don't want your genitals in that mouth, I tell you. That would be deadly. And also, you know, she probably hasn't got the best breath either, has she? So just keep slamming through the dialogues for now. And like I said, like I said, so for the first playthrough, always pick the top option. Um, and we're just going to get achievements by the absolute boatload. So again, every time you're on a dialogue option, just choose the first, the top one. Um, we're never choosing the second one for this playthrough, but we are going to be coming up to another uh, quick time event soon. But for now, just again, slap out all of the top dialogue. My instant noodle days are over. Mine too. Now I'm on to regular noodles, which gives you the craps. It wouldn't hurt. I've got some... So here's the most annoying quick time event. So you basically just got to get the arrow in between the red. Uh, that sounds easy, but it doesn't do it straight away. So you've got to press the A button quite a bit before um, you get to the red bit in the middle. And obviously after the third attempt, it does get a bit quicker. So again, this one may take about just a few minutes. So you need to be hitting the A button quite far before the arrow gets to the red part. Again, as you will see. Um, otherwise it can just be, and again, make sure to try, if you can, try and get it the first two times. If not, you should get it after a couple of attempts, but it can be a bit tricky in terms of where to actually press the A button. So, for now anyway, just keep on slapping out that, uh, top, top, titty, titty, witty, bitty, witty. Or, or just the, um, top dialogue option. That's of course what I meant. Hehehe. <laughs> I was talking with Zachary. So for this next qu next quick time event, I highly recommend just spamming the X and Y button as quick as you can. Basically, this uh, witch is going to appear, this ghost is going to appear in different directions. Sometimes it'll be X, sometimes it'll be Y. But just keep spamming the X and Y button, and then eventually, after three times, that one will be over. And life will be good. Even though we've got this genital tearing ghost after us, which is na na na. That no good. Oh my god. Again, top dialogue options. Keep slamming them out for now. I don't know about you two, but I think you guys... Sorry. 
sorry, sir. I, I was just... My sister just had a baby, you know. I think it would be better if you... And for the final quick time event, what we have to do, we basically have to just take a picture of the ghost. Now, you press the A button to um, take a picture. And obviously, as you can see at the top right hand corner, you see a battery going down. Uh, so try and either listen out for the noise. Um, but the more the battery goes down, the, it, the picture gets ever so brighter. So all you'll be able to see is like the faintest sort of silhouette of a ghost when you get to it. So I do end up feeling it the first time. Um, just because the shine off certain objects always look like the ghost But always try and like I said just try and listen to where she might be um, Otherwise, you know that is <laughs> well that is one for the anal tear room <laughs> Ouch. You don't want a girl like that scramming you like that that man that hurts Otherwise, we can just skip it go back to this bit then and, you know, just take your time with it. Again, try and listen out to where she is. And try and take a few more pictures so the room brightens up. And just always look out for that sort of faintest silhouette of where ghosty McTerry nuts are. <laughs> so, when the Daredevil achievement unlocks there, win for... Q to ease and normal difficulty. Now we can just go all the way over to the right into the options menu, press the Y button, um, right bumper twice to go to gameplay, and now we can skip the quick time events. So, of course, the difficulty doesn't matter, um, but we can now skip the quick time events because we don't need them anymore. So, happy days. So, again, just for now, then keep slamming out the top, top titty dialogue. And uh, until we basically end this first full playthrough. We're both drunk. Shouldn't you be asking her this? You're not going to go out there and join Mrs. Wright? And during the open house? Mister, you have until the count of... What does he have to do with this? Just stay busy and you'll be okay. Thank you. You okay? You're limping. Okay. Forget it, Belle. You're not going back to that. So that is basically it then for this first playthrough. And uh, so what we can do is just skip a bunch of cutscenes and everything right here just to get through it. And that'll be the end of the first playthrough. I gotta, I gotta give it to the um, any developers who do visual novels. The achievement descriptions are always literally bang on point. They are so good. Um, but sadly, uh, you know, there are a lot of achievement hunters who just are that. They just don't know what's going on because they just slam out the spam out the achievements. So, anyway, that is playthrough number one. So, for playthrough number two, we obviously don't have to do any quick time events. 
But all we're going to be doing for this playthrough, half a playthrough anyway, is choosing the second dialogue option. So never choosing the top dialogue option. All we're doing is just choosing the second dialogue option, the bottom one. So for instance, you're not my mom. I press my lips together. Um, but yeah, so just choose the second dialogue option. Somebody needs to trim them uh, bad boy toes right there. Blech. Yeah, second dialogue option anyway, all the way through. And I'll obviously let you know when we can nip on and basically quit. So second dialogue option, bottom one, always throughout this dialogue um, playthrough event. Let me do that again. Don't bother. <laughs> you are such a big baby. Um, I'm... Yes, I am... I'll stop if it makes you uncomfortable, sweetie. I was just tending to the garden, sweetie. Be honest with me, Marianne. You look like you're about to pass out. So, I hope you've been choosing the bottom dialogue option all this way, because if you have, you should now get an, another achievement, and we can basically quit now. Um, so, as soon as you get the professor achievement right there, consulting the professor with the photographs, then we can just go back to the main menu, quit out, and then begin a new game. So, we should only have now three achievements left, but for this playthrough, we need to be uh, picking specific dialogue options. So... Uh, this time, I'll let you know, of course, but, you know, just be wary. I mean, it only takes a couple of seconds to, you know, a couple of minutes to get to another point. But, first one is the top option. I eat other hey, things too, like pinus. <laughs> Next one is top option again, be brave. Next, after skipping this bit, choose the second dialogue option, I don't know. Or the bottom dialogue option, I don't know. Then the top one, which is show the letter to Rose. Then uh, choose the top one again, change the subject. You keep asking me about my work. Then choose the top one again, stay for the movie. Why not? When you're in the movie, we're going to choose the bottom option, meet with the professor, you dirty little ting. Um, number one, the top one, my instant noodle dates are over. Okay. Let me do that again. Next, choose the top option again, just trying to help, or I know you're trying to help. Now choose the top option again. You're not bad after all. And then, now we can choose the second option. Talk about her job. Um, I'm... Now choose the top option. Go to work. Work, 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 work. I am not a jerk. Next, choose the bottom option. Defend myself. Yes, I am very... And then choose the top option. Free up my schedule. Just, I guess we... Then choose the bottom option, ask for her silence. And then the bottom option again, stop it. I'll stop if it makes you and the bottom option again, I was tending the gardens, my dear. I was just tending to the garden. Next, choose the top option, open the hatch and crappy pants. Then choose the bottom option, be honest with me, honey. Be honest with Does my ass look big in this? I... Then choose the <laughs> second option again, tell the truth. Does my ass look big in this? Then choose the bottom option again. I know you're busy, but does my ass look big in this? Uh, <laughs> no. Choose the top option. Show the photo to Hannah. And the top one again. I'm a friend of Hannah's. Sorry, sir. I, I was just... Uh, next, choose the top option. Uh, do you think a crib would make a good gift? A baby, you know? And the top option again. Show her the pictures. I think it would be better if you... Then the top option again. We can still fix this. It ain't too late. My ass didn't fit in those jeans. Second option, uh, enter the open window. Then the bottom option again. Nothing, never mind. Nothing, never mind. 
Never mind. At the top option, you have something to say. Top option again. Check, check, checking it out. Top option again. I have work to do, sir. And the bottom option, we can compromise. The bottom option again, check the first floor. Then the bottom option again, you must have been must quite, the, been pair. quite hmm. the pair. Which pair? Wink, wink. The bottom option again, ask if he's alright. Hey, right and then the top option, I need to move on. And then that will be the end of the game. So, well, there we go. Let's just wait until the achievement unlocks. There it is. So that's it then, guys and gals. So thank you so, so much for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed the game, and I hope the guide helped as well. If it did, of course, don't forget to uh, like, comment, subscribe, and share with a friend as well. Don't forget to check me out on my socials, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Patreon as well. Big huge shout out to everyone who continues to support the channel on Patreon. Guys and gals are just legends. And there we have it then. So I shall see you in the next one, guys and gals. Big love.